Guess who's back, bitches? As you command. That's right. Come back if you need some. That is fucking right. I don't need you. Hey. Hey, Fuck. hey. I don't need you, motherfucker. I got Sharon. And he all I need, baby. You all I need. You all I need, boo. You know that? You know what's up. All right, let me, uh... Let's see if this works. Hmm. Uh, okay, wait. Do you have to... Interesting. Uh, okay, so... Set... Essential... 0001... 56F6. Let's see if that works. So you can't die now, correct? I'm assuming you can't die now. Beautiful. Let's save. Okay, so we are going to go back to Big Town and collect Bittercup. Uh, let's go. Um, I needed to have Fox or uh, this guy, Sharon. Um, I would have bet a billion dollars I wouldn't have been able to resurrect him and get him to work again, but somehow... I don't know, somehow the glitch that he was like, talk to Azrakal, somehow it didn't, it, it ended, so thank God for that, because I actually would rather have him, even though he's not nearly as good at fighting as Fox is. There she is. If he's essential, it doesn't matter. Let's go back and get, uh, get Bittercup. Bittercup, where you be at? Wake up. It's time to go. You came to visit. You'll never guess what I found out in the wastes when I was supposed to be patrolling. All of the shit that I Here, gave you? This is for you. Oh. Really? I, I mean, um... I watched someone die once. Yeah. The boys are back in town. The boys are back in town. Bow. 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 The boys are back in town. Oh, Alright, let's go. We've got things to do. Uh, the next thing hey, yeah. to do. So, what do you do after you get out of Raven Rock? I believe we have to go back to the Citadel. I'm not 100% on that, but I'm pretty sure you gotta go, uh, go back to, um, what do you call to uh, the Citadel. I do need to get Sharon some power armor at some point, so that really sort of fits in with what we're trying to do anyway. Yeah, it's telling me to go back to the Citadel. Good, because I could just kill anybody there and take their power armor. I'm actually going to kill two people there and take one power armor for me, the other one for him. Hi there, Mr. Guard. I don't think that... Uh, yeah. Sorry about that. Yeah. Right, you're unconscious. Yeah. Where's the cheeseburgers? Hopefully they don't hate ghouls in here. Okay, so we gotta find one of these guys who is killable. Are you killable? Why aren't my companions here? My companions can't come into the Citadel, seriously. Oh my god, that pisses me off. Oh, okay, at least you're really dead. I'll take that. And you can have my Enclave armor. And they'll all think that you were Enclave, and so they won't be upset for me murdering you. Um, shit. Oh god. That sucks, man. Alright, let me get an extra one of these, and then I'll... She's gonna go back. What are you doing? You moonwalking? Motherhood is at your service. Why'd you stop dancing? Oh, you you going again? No. Oh. Oh well, this mission sucks. I love how your freaking companions can't come in here with you. That's stupid as hell. 
the Citadel, you just can't see the Citadel because it's a sacred place. Oh, never mind. I like how they make it like it's a great place. This place is a shittle. It's a shittle. All I'm saying is, the longer we sit here, the more time they have to shore up their defenses. We should hit them sooner rather than later. Cutscene. We barely have the manpower to keep the Citadel fortified. We've been over this before, Sarah. So we just wait until they decide we're next on the list? If the Pride goes in now, we might have a chance. And if you fail, then what? The risk is not worth the reward. I agree. Without the Gek, the Purifier is useless to the Enclave anyway. They may give up before long. I don't like it. You don't have to like it, Sarah. You just have to follow orders. Yes, Father. Hi, Santa. Oh, so, you're back. We had feared both you and the Gek were lost. Were you successful? Santa, apparently you don't know me very well. Excellent. With that, we hold the key to keeping the Enclave from controlling the Purifier. It's not quite that simple. What do you mean? Explain yourself. I don't have to explain. <laughs> That's a dick thing to say. Then we must go at once. If you have any other information, tell me now before we mobilize. Any help you can give might save lives. Um, Eden wanted me to sabotage the project with some kind of a virus. I see. And where is this virus now? I have it. Here. Thank you. I'll see to it that it's disposed of properly once the scribes have had time to analyze it. Perhaps we have underestimated the Enclave. Sarah may be right. An attack may be necessary now. Can I also tell you that they're not as unified as they once were? stopping them from starting the purifier. They'll figure out the code eventually. I'm afraid you're right. We need to act now while we can. Send the pride in. We can do it. We can win this. All right, Sarah. The pride goes in. But I want them to have some extra firepower. Rothschild, is it ready? What? No, I, I mean, Lee and I have solved the power problems, but we've only barely finished diagnostic tests. So? It's not ready for field tests, let alone live fire situations. The weapons haven't been calibrated, the navigation detection system is offline. Rothschild enough, and you make it work. Honestly, I don't know. I think we can scrape by, and I suppose if we can't, it won't matter in the long run anyway. Then it's decided. Sarah, you take the pride and use the robot as support. Take our friend here and secure that purifier. Yes, sir. Before we get started, I wanted to let you know that my father and I have been talking. The pride and I have decided that after all you've survived, you've done enough to be an honorary member of Lion's Pride. Psh. So congratulations. Bitch, the membership you comes don't even, I don't even want to be in your, oh, oh yeah, armor. I wanted the power armor. Or the recon armor. Uh, power armor for sure, because I need to give it to, uh. Sure thing. Hopefully, it'll give you a bit of an extra edge. Okay. Of course. Now that's what, you all packed? Hurry it up. Shut up, you whore. All right, I have got two. Okay, I'm going to do two things. First of all, I'm going to take that power armor. And I'm gonna give this one to uh to Sharon. Talk to Azra Khan. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. 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 Go talk to No. No. Go no. talk to Azra. No. No. Yeah. You seeing this right now? You you seeing what's you seeing this? So here's what we're gonna do. This isn't gonna do me <laughs> any good. If I can't have dialogue with him, then there's no reason for him to be here. Um Talk to Asla King Jesus. Really? God. Alright. Um there's two things I can do. I can either set the quest uh, his quest to the stage it needs to be on to have him follow me or 
I can alter my um, uh, what do you call I don't know, whatever, the reputation or whatever that makes you good or evil. Karma. And uh, go get Fox. I think I'm going to do the latter. He'll still follow me and fight for me, but I'm not going to be able to talk to him. And in that case, he's of absolutely no use to me. So if he dies, I don't care. Okay, so I'm going to be back. Okay, we're back. Got Fox. Um, so now we've got Sharon. Um, what? Whoa. What? Huh? Something. No. All right. This is a weird situation. I'm going to, um, <laughs> uh, yep. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, he's supposed to be waiting here. Um, he said he'd be at the Museum of History. Uh, so I waited here for like three fucking days and he never showed up. So I just teleported him here. Uh, so yeah, now we got Sharon. You are you still? No. Yeah. Go figured. talk. All right, shut the hell up. I don't care. But goddamn, as recall, let's go. Let's go to the Citadel. Let's go back to the Citadel. I don't want to be the Citadel, but we gotta be at the Citadel. Actually, this is the end of the game. I don't know if you guys realize that. Uh, this last little bit here, this last battle. Uh, and then we're going to do the DLCs. You know what? Actually, right now might be the time to do the DLCs. Hmm. Yeah. So, guys. Surprise DLC start. Here we go. Uh... I don't think Bittercup's gonna follow me into DLC land. I know Fox doesn't follow me into DLC land. Um, all right, well, we'll start in DLC tonight. That's weird that I didn't realize we were gonna have to do that. We moved through the story a little quicker on those last few videos than I thought. So, which DLC do we want to start tonight? I think I'll start Point Lookout. Let's figure it out. Riverboat Landing. Big wheels keep on turning. Rolling, rolling, rolling on a river. Okay, Fox, you will do whatever. You either wait here or don't. I don't care what you do. Uh, yeah, you just, um, you do what you gotta do. Bittercup, please don't stay here. Please come with me. You! Are you going to Point Lookout? I need your help. No. My daughter stowed away on the Duchess Gambit a few weeks ago, and I've been worried sick ever since. No. I haven't heard anything from her, but if you're going there, could you look for her? Please, I'll do anything to help. Anything you say? Um, I'll look for her. Oh, bless you. Her name is Nadine, and she Nadine, left a couple of weeks ago. Nadine, Said she wanted Nadine, to see the world. Nadine, Nadine, Nadine. Silly little thing that she is. I'm begging that of you, please don't take my man. Her off at Point Lookout, but who knows what's happened to her since then? I don't know if you can convince my little Nadine to come back, but just give her this note from me, would you? Okay. Um. Please. I'll find your daughter. I don't need to uh, go through the goddamn details. I know where her daughter is. Uh, I'm not gonna spoil it because that's kind of one of the things about the DLC that. It's fun to find out later, but I guess... Welcome, my friend. I am Tobar the Ferryman, and this fine vessel is the Duchess Gambit. Tobar the We're Ferryman. We're just back from Point Lookout, but it won't be long before we set off again. Nice jacket. Are you from Seattle? Um, there. You look like a woman who's been around the wastes, so I'll cut right to it. In Point Lookout, you'll find fresh-grown food, mysterious locales, and treasures as of yet unlooted. Mm -hmm. But keep your wits about you, because there's more than a few exotic critters and inhospitable locals. So stay here if you're too dainty to rough it. Tell me I'm dainty, motherfucker. Um, yeah, where's Nadine? Ah, Nadine. Sprightly little tomboy with more curiosity than common sense, that one. <laughs> 
caused so much trouble on the trip that I probably would have thrown her overboard <laughs> if she hadn't reminded me of myself at her age. I haven't seen her since we hit land at Point Lookout, but knowing her, I'll bet she's gotten herself in plenty of trouble. Really? You sure you're telling the truth? Because I'll kill you. Um... You should have seen her back in her heyday. Why, we traveled up and down the coast from the Commonwealth to the Broken Banks. Good times, but these days she's not fit to take out to the coast. Too many spouts ready to drown her and too many critters looking for lunch. But the Point Lookout run is good enough for now. We've got a sweet deal ferrying cargo and the occasional traveler. Looking for fame and fortune? Hoping to cultivate the delicious punga fruit? Oh, or just well, take looking to run away backs. from your life on these dreary I will shores? I give you... This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Um, I'll give you that, because I don't actually need it anymore. Do I have any more of those alien crystals? You want to buy some meth? I have some meth. Buy some meth. Um, and then also, uh, 11 diamonds, and, uh, some cigarettes, and give me your riverboat ticket, just, just the one, I don't, I don't need all of them, just the one, and, uh, take a lunchbox and a metro ticket, um, you can take some of these smaller crystals, five of them, uh, to be exact, I actually take all of them because I don't need them. And uh, you can have some more cigarettes also. There you go. Um, do I need anything else? Once you've got a ticket, just head into the. Oh, wait, wait, say that again. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Shit. Whenever you're ready. Wish I listened to what he just said. Okay, guys, let's go. You are staying in here with me. I don't care what the hell happened to the other two, but you are not going anywhere, Bittercup. Fox, it's like you're the odd man out, buddy. Wait, is this my cot? Where's my cot? Where my cot be? All right, Fox. See you later. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. Bittercup went back to Big Town. Don't tell me better cut my back to bed down. I'll I'll be depressed about that. That would suck. I would hate that. Okay, that I don't care about. I assume Azrakal man. I keep reading his name Sharon. I, I assume he's still with me just because I use the restaurant console command and then the player plays the main console command, so why can't I look around? This is weird as hell. Okay. Well, can't move. Can't move. Yeah. Weird. I don't know if that was supposed to happen or not, but, uh,. I guess I was supposed to look at a house for like 10 minutes. Where's my, uh, I don't care about you. Don't talk Welcome to me. Welcome to Point Lookout. Suck a ball. The trip was fine. I don't care. Look I don't care. Um... Oh, it's smoke all right. Where there's smoke there. That smoke's coming from old Calvert Mansion. I always heard if it was If you guys want to read this, just pause it. I know I said Point Lookout was perfect for treasure hunter. Okay, just just pause it if you want to read this, um, because I don't care what he has to say it at all. I'm only oh shit, sorry. I'm only interested in seeing if my companions came with me. If they didn't, I don't care. What else this guy has to say? Did you throw them off the boat? Did you murder them? I'ma be pissed. I'ma be I'm I'm I'ma be pissed if you threw my back? companions up a motherfucking bridge. He did, he threw my companions out. Son of a bitch. Alright. Oh well. I still have my power armor. Alright, at least I still have my power armor. That bums me out, man. At least I would have wanted to take Bitter Cup, you know? That can't be. 
Wait, can I just kill him? Ugh. Yeah, that's annoying as hell. I really want a better cup to come with me. Oh, well. She could follow me into space, but not into Louisiana. Or Maryland, or whatever the hell. I think this is Maryland. Alright. Well, there's uh, things to do here. A plenty. Uh, this is a pretty cool DLC. I do like it a lot. It is one of my favorites. I, I really like all the DLCs for this game, if we're being honest. Um, but this is one of my favorites. I'd say it's my second favorite. Next to, uh, I, I like the pit. So, that'll be the last one we're going to do. Uh, but yeah, let's head to... Oh, look, there's a guy. He said there were friendly locales here. Let's, uh, let's check and see if that is, in fact, the can I can't jump over this, uh... That's a bloat fly. I'd like my weapons, please. Let's use, uh... Um, where'd old Painless go? There she is. Rolling on the river. Rolling. Rolling. Rolling on the river. Wow, I am shooting you point blank and not killing you. You are some kind of special. Ah... Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I really want better cup. This is lame without her. Just traveling around the wasteland alone without listening to her. Oh, I hate life. I want to die. I'm going to teleport her here. I'll be back. <laughs>